Hmm. I wonder how I could make a Laguidi out of these fishes. Hey, what's good, you guys? Welcome back to more Mario 64 with me, your host, j -Ruff. Uh, in the last episode, we took care of most of the stars in Jolly Roger Bay, and we got a secret star located in one of these, uh, swimming tanks, and we also, uh, obtained the wing cap, and the, um... Uh, the star in that uh, wing cap course. Now, we will be getting the final star that we can get up to this point in Jolly Roger Bay. Blast to the Stone Pillar. Now, uh, this one's actually quite simple. I could have probably fit this in the last episode, but it was going a little bit long with that 100 coin mission, so I decided not to. But very simply, what you need to do, you might have seen the star in the background a couple times, uh, you need to sh launch yourself so that you land on one of these pillars. So, I think that should be a good enough height. Yeah! Perfect! And we get a 1-up. Wow. I'm surprised I got that in one shot. Alright, now if we just angle ourselves this way... So we take some... <laughs> I like how that was enough to make us take damage, but whatever. Anyways, we got our star! Number 24! And with that, Jolly Roger Bay is going to be put to a close for now, because we cannot get the last stars, we need another power-up to do so. However, next up, we're going to be going to another one of my favorite levels. Uh, it gives me a really hard time, honestly, but I have I, I still hold it very near and dear to my heart. So with the star power, yes, the door will open, we know. And look at this, we have three paintings. Let's, yeah. you know what, I'm feeling fun. Let's go in the right one. Oh, I, I guess not. What, the left one? Yeah. Oh. Why are you here? All right, whatever, let's just get in here. And welcome to the first snowy level of the game. Cool, cool mountain. Slip sliding away. Snow Mountain Summit, watch for slippery conditions. Please enter the cottage first. So in this level, oh, I'm... My A button got stuck, so I just was a jumping like mad. So, uh, if you watched my, uh, winter update video, this is where... Oh, Santa Claus isn't the only one who could go down a chimney! Come on in! Okay, I like how... So wait, Santa Claus is in the Mario universe? I don't think he's ever made an appearance. So, uh, yeah. If you watched my winter update video, this was the music that I used. And that was a clue that this was gonna be one of the next games that I played. Uh, I also had a Madagascar thing in there that was also supposed to give you that hint. But anyways, slip sliding away, we got a slide right here. Now, uh, unlike the last level, this is a pretty easy 100 coin mission to do because you can get a lot of the coins right here. Uh, however, this slide is a lot more slippery than the other one that we did in the beginning of the game. Or, well no, it was only like a, an episode ago. Uh, but if we go through this little passageway here, we get an easy shortcut to get to the bottom. I'm showing this off now because future attempts at the slide, we will not be able to actually use this whole area. Um, similarly to why we couldn't do the uh, Koopa the Quick thingamabobber. Anyways, after we're done with that, as the door opens, we get our first star of the cool, cool mountain. Hold on, there's a penguin over here. Egad! Oh, are you talking about the professor? My baby, have you seen my baby? She's the most precious baby in the whole wide world. They say she has a beak, or she has my beak. I just can't remember where I left her. Well, your beak is on your face, so shouldn't she be on your face? Let's see, I stopped for herring. I stopped for herring and ice cubes, and then I, oh, I just don't know. What the fuck is herring? I have no idea what that is. Anyways, <laughs> let's just get our star. Alright, well, that was a hint, uh, the penguin was a hint to our next mission, which, if you know this mission, it's probably the most notorious mission of this entire, uh, level, I would say. It is... Little Penguin Lost! And if you can see right up there, we got a little penguin. Now, there is a little penguin at the cottage at the bottom that is not the right penguin. And for some reason, there is no mother for that penguin. So that penguin's just lost, and no one gives a shit, apparently. So we go up to him. I like how it's also, it's clearly like a, just a smaller model of the old penguin. But yeah, once we grab the penguin, we gotta do some sliding. 
Uh, now we could just, like, jump off. So I think I will. Which will just save us a little bit more time. And yeah, if you fall from a great height, you won't take damage, thankfully, in this level. Oh, but we'll be sliding for sure. Come on, give me... Can I get you? Can I... Penguin! I like how the penguin fell. Come on, come here, you. Don't look at the weird head thing over there. It's not important. Alright, so be careful with these guys. These guys are kind of a pain. If you touch them, they will do damage onto you. Even though they're just simple snowmen. Alright, and don't squish me? Okay, very nice. And there we go. You see down there, this is the little penguin that we thought could have possibly been this one belonging to this lady. But it is not. Oh, she's actually going to her mama. Does it actually count if it... Okay, whatever. <laughs> like, you found my precious baby! Where have you been? How could I ever thank you, Mario? Okay, I do have this star. Here, take it, with my eternal gratitude. Why do you have a star, and why were you just not letting us have it? Alright, well, whatever. Now, uh, what we can do here, is what a lot of people like to do, is now, if we run away with the penguin, she'll try to ta chase us, and we can just toss his ass right off. I said, toss his ass right off. I said, toss his ass right off. There we go. No baby for you. That's what you get for your holding a star. Here we go! Now she's forever lost with her, her boy, baby, baby. Alright, that was the next one still, and then we're gonna go back, because we have another slide to do. Being so sly like Sly Cooper, you know what I'm saying? The Big Penguin Race! So after taking care of that, we can go in here, and I believe... We have a Challenger! Hey, hey, Mario buddy, how's it going? Step right up! You look like fast sledding kinda guy! I know speed when I see it. Yes, sirree. I'm the world champion slutter, you know? What do you say? How about a race? Ready? Go. And yeah, he gets a fucking head start on us. So I believe this is like the penguin's dad or something. Um, but you cannot take the shortcut that I said before because he'll call you up for cheating, much like Koopa the Quick. Also be careful because this guy could try to bump you off. Um, and yeah, this is actually a decently difficult kind of race. Also, if you... Fuck! Yeah, this might take me a bunch of attempts. If you fall off and try to, like, jump to, like, a bottom, like, a track below you, it will actually just, you know, it will... He'll also say you're cheating. So you, the only way to win is to, like, legit just get to the bottom of... No, I didn't want to... I don't give a shit about Santa Claus's fat ass and chimneys. He's not giving me presents right now, so it's not... We're not up for that, alright? But yeah, I think this is actually the hardest mission that we have so far. Because this is slide, this slide gives me all types of trouble. I think this is actually the hardest slide to, to actually race. Like, to get to the bottom without actually falling, this is the hardest one, I believe. Alright, this fucking guy is also just up my buttock. Alright, come on. Okay, and he really has to push me at this time! Fuck, that turn always gets me! You know, I think I'm gonna try to jump. That might actually help me just get my balance there. Alright, well, I'm gonna cut till I get back to that same point so we can continue the race and not take a million hours. Alright, slow and steady, and okay, we did that. Alright, now there's a lot of coins here. If you're looking for, uh, just to scout out coins for the 100 coin mission, you can miss very easily right there. I don't know what that log thing was in the background. And a lot of coins right there, and we did it! It only took me, like, I think that was actually just the same attempt that I said. I I have a uh, short-term memory loss, it seems. You broke my record! Unbelievable! That I knew that you were the coolest. Now you've proven that you're also the fastest. I can't award you a gold medal, but here, take the star and said you've earned it. I thought stars were considered gold medals by penguins. Whatever. There we go. Get our star! And with that, we're almost halfway done with Cool Mountain already, and unlike the last level, we could actually get all of the stars in this level. Right off Rippington. Frosty Slide for eight red coins. Now, this is actually a little bit misleading, because the slide does not contain the red... the hundred... the... Bleh, does not contain the red coins that you might need. Um, however, 
it does, um, what do you call it? It does, uh, what, do you, what, do you, what am I trying to say? It does have, uh, a bunch of coins if you're trying to do the 100 coin mission, which I am going to attempt to do right now. And also, we got a little bit of a board here, and these guys, I believe they're called headhunters. Which is weird, because they're like little flowery hues. I don't know. Um, but we, we don't want to go sliding down there. I'm going to actually slide on the, uh, the, um, uh, slide once more. Hopefully I don't die. And this time we don't actually have to race. Except I think he will, like, go over He He'll be here. Just don't hit go, alright? Just hit don't go every time, and he won't bother us. So now we can actually take our time. I said no! Leave me alone! Sheesh. Alright, now this is the last time we'll be sliding on here, so I'll leave it in. Screw it. Alright, not going that fast. Alright. Alright, we missed two. That's fine. There's loads of coins here. And there's loads of coins in this level that we haven't even gotten yet. Oof. I missed a bunch there, though. That could cost me. I get two. Oh! I got I almost passed. Alright, there we go. A lot of coins. We already got almost more coins than we did on our actual slide run. So that's good. Alright, and there we go. We have 62, and I believe this will give us 77! Nice! And we only gotten like one red coin so far too, so that's a, that's a plus. Now if we do that, it'll actually do the first star for us. I don't know why, but it is what it is. Uh, and here we go. Red coin number two. And uh, Mario, get down. Get down, Mario! Mario! What are you having today? Alright, um, over here, there's another red coin. We'll get that one in a sec, because there's a red coin easily missed right here. Also, be careful, because you can easily slide off. Um, we're gonna go past this red coin really quick, because there is another thing that we should probably tend to. Uh, that I think we're just gonna, gonna want to get out of the way really quick, because you see there's a ba bomb cannon right there, and there's also one over there that you can see is open. No, now it's not open. And right here is our big ba bomb friend. They put him in a really fucking precarious position in this fucking level for some reason. But at least it's like right next to the cannon, so you know, like, oh, I gotta look for this dude. Bit 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 Alright. Now we gotta wait for this thing. Be very careful, because you will die if you fall off right here. Alright, and just so you know, we will need the use of the cannons, I believe. OH COME ON! And the wind was supposed to pick me up too, and it didn't. Oh, great. Well, I'll just cut so we can get that fucking slide taken care of. Alright, we done did it. We got 83. Thankfully, we don't have to do that cannon again, so we don't have to worry about that right now. Uh, we'll take care of that a little bit later. Just go on over here. Also, I'm missing a life, as you can tell. Yeah, I died on the, uh, my next attempt on the, uh, on the slide, because I jumped. And, wouldn't you know it, the jump knocked me off. That was tremendous. Anyways, there's a reason why I saved this one for, uh, after. And that's because, if we go over here, very carefully, so as to not fall off, we have another warp point, which warps us right back to the top of the mountain, which is good. So that we can get this, the coins not on the uh, the slide over there, but rather the natural slide of the wa the water, the snow right here. And we're at 92, which means that we're about to finish, I believe. This should be enough. Or I can't count. Alright, so three coins. However, it's going to be a little bit tough because, as you know, the star likes to appear right above. I think we can get it. I think we can get it. Yeah! Alright! So at least now, for sure, we have the 100 coin mission done. So all we gotta worry about now is the red coins. And it is very easy to die in this level, I should point out. It's very easy to just slip and slide right off. Okay, I don't need these coins, so fuck them. Alright, and also the coins in this mission, the red coins, I should say, they're a little bit tricky to find. Or at least they get a little tricky to find at some points. So I believe... Oh no, there isn't one over here. I thought there was one just, like, hiding off. I think there is one hiding off. Uh, okay. I was gonna say, if I don't... I don't want to slip the fuck off at that red... For that, uh, coin right there. 
Alright, we got a cannon up here. I don't exactly understand why. Uh, here's the carousel. The carousel. The cage. I don't, I don't know why I said that. The carousel. Um, there's a little area over around here that holds two coins. Alright, come on. Come on, Mr. Snowman. Jump over me, please. Thank you. And over here, and if you can see up ahead, that is actually where the uh, other coin, uh, the star is going to appear. So we need to do a long jump over here. And now these guys are also helpful for your oh, 100 coin mission. I'll just quickly show off how to beat them. So these snow snowmen like to just stand here and throw snowballs at you. But what you can do is if you... Okay, come on. It's really hard to do it here because it's so slippery. Okay, you don't forget it. I'm just not I'm not gonna bother. Basically, if you circle them, oh, he's throwing snowballs at us off the edge. That's kind of funny. Um, if you circle him, he will uh, he will disappear. He'll melt because he's spinning around so much, and he will become uh, five points, which is cool. Uh, blue coin, I should say. All right, so now here we're gonna be very careful to make it to the other side right here. Bingo! And once again, we went through this thing. Interesting. Alright, and now we gotta get in this cannon, because... I believe, anyway, it's over here. Uh... No, it's not. Okay, well... Shoot right into that wall right there. Okay, I don't exactly remember how I'm supposed to get to the area where the, uh, the last coins are. So I'm gonna actually probably cut here just to figure that out on my own. Uh, I don't want to fucking fall off though. It's just I say right about there's probably good. Yep. All right, and yeah, I'm gonna cut just to see how to get into that island there because I still I always have a little bit of an issue with that. All right, now we're back up here where we teleported to. Now, if you can see from here. Zoom right there. No, I can't really. Mario, you kind of have to turn around. Alright. You see right here, there's a little bit of a slope down there. I can't really see it. I don't want to... I didn't want to do that! Can you can you get back, you fuck, you schmuck, you butt? Alright, now turn back around. Alright, now you see that there's a little bit of a slope and it leads to the final red coins. Let's get down right up there. Just be careful because you can easily slide off. And here we go. We made it. Give me that. Thank you very much. I very much appreciate it. And, uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Easy there, buddy. Easy. We go around there. We get red coin number seven. And, uh, I thought that was where also the other one was. Um, I guess I'm gonna have to do some more searching. Also, let's just talk to this guy. Oh no, talk about other body experiences. Is my body not a little why? At least three one of the head on others lately. I'm not sure he's a body. So this is my free face, my phrase like this. So yeah, we gotta find that guy a body. Unfortunately, we can't do that un until we get the selected mission for that guy. So for now, he's just gonna have to be a bodiless bongo. Um, I really wanna know where that red coin is. I think it might be over here? No. Alright, well, cut! I don't fall off, but... Oh, yeah, it is right here! What the fuck? I was gonna say, like, I, I remember it being, like, on a tiny ledge around here, but... Oh, fuck. No! Alright, these snowmen we can't actually mess with. Jump over me, please. Ow! I said over! Over! Alright, perfect. Just perfect. Alright, now we gotta make the true leap of faith. If you know what a long jump... Oh! Macaroni Mario. I wish I just got hit by, like, a snowball there. That would be what would have been most humorous. Um, okay. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not! Okay, okay. Alright, I guess I'm just gonna have to cut. Again, just to get back up to that fucking... Actually, no, we can actually just go this way. Well, I mean, I'll still cut, just cuz. Alright, Mario, this time with feeling. 
Yes, we done did it! Red coin and 100 coin mission, and look, there's the 5 coin thing right over there that we didn't even need. So yeah, I believe that like the most coins we could get so far are in Cool Cool Mountain. Very, very interesting if I do say so myself. Now, Snowman's lost his head. So there's a snowman that's lost his head, you see? That actually helps, because if we need a guy that doesn't have a head, we found a guy who needs a body. And if you look over here, now, there's actually a thingamawatsit over here. Thingamawatsit. This mission is kind of tricky. I need a good head on my shoulders. You know anybody in need of a good body, please, I'll follow you if you do. So now, we gotta deal with this snowball that will continuously roll down the mountain. Not continuously. Um, but what we gotta do is not fall off the fucking mountain! Yeah. Mario, stop! Mario, stop! Okay, now, what we have to do is we have to lead him to the other guy. Not by doing that! Uh, now we're not actually gonna be able to get in front of him, which is necessary. Alright, if we just go down here, this is a much safer way of doing it. But he's gonna come really fast. Here he comes. We gotta just maintain our 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 place in front of him, and just lead him. Lead him. No, you fuck! What are you doing? He went in the cannon. He went inside the cannon. Um. All right. Here comes Snowball. Here comes the snowman. Go right here. Why? Why do you do this, snowman? WHAT HAVE I DONE TO YOU?! Alright, well, I suppose we have to maintain our distance in front of the snowman, so maybe we should just stick with the slide this whole time. Alright, just try not to slip off like I did. Like a moron. Alright, keep sliding, Mario. Keep sliding. Keep sliding. Keep sliding, and... That should work. Hey, We did it! Too bad it was off-screen, but we done did it! Another, uh, what I would consider to be a little bit of a challenging mission. Perfect! What a great new body! Here, this is a present for you. It's sort of warm you up. So yeah, our snowman now has a big old body, and he'll be here happily on this platform forever. It's not like he gets up and walks around at all. Nope, he just stays right the fuck there. Snowman's lost head. Alright, and now... You've recovered 30 power stars, now you can open the door with the big star! But before you, you move on, how's it going otherwise? <laughs> did you pound the two columns down? You didn't lose your hat, did you? If you did, you'll have to stop on the condor to get it- What are you- What are you talking about? Bowser sneaked out to sea and moved into underground? We haven't even fought Bowser yet! What are you- What are you on about, fucking game? Alright, wall kicks will work. This is the last one and possibly the trick- The hardest one to, like, find here. Um, basically, I guess we'll just warp down to the bottom. That might be easier. Uh, or I could've just went over there. I mean, that's just a slide anyway. Alright, so, this one's a little bit tricky and kind of hard to find. You cannot do this one, I think, without- I mean, when I actually first- No, I- I already saved your baby, alright? I- we don't- you don't have a star for me anymore. You have no use to me. We saved your baby and threw her off a cliff. Alright. So, I actually accidentally made it over to this area, uh, without the cannon, but, you, you know, it is very possible to do so. Uh, but you can, um, you know, the way that you're actually supposed to do it is like so, and we barely made that. Alright, so when we get over here, you notice you have these guys over here that are gonna try to mess you up. But a simple punch, or just them walking into us as well, that, that works fine. Uh, we'll get rid of them. Boom! Alright, and we make it over here to the secret area. Uh, we also could have done the, uh, little, like, uh, was it the, uh, long jump that would have helped us? I don't know. And yeah, even more coins over here. Remember that tricky wall kick jump? It's a technique you'll have to master in order to reach high places. Use the jump from wall to wall. Stick to blah 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 blah. Alright, so remember the wall jump I showed you guys. This is actually the first time where it's actually necessary. Now, there's a heart here, because you're gonna be falling quite a bit doing this if you don't know how to do it just right. So, uh, once you get over here, you're basically able to just keep retrying this to your leisure, pretty much. And, uh, you don't- you won't get kicked out because you won't- e you easily won't die if you make use of that heart right there. Alright, so what we gotta do... You see right there, this is where the heart comes in handy. Uh, 
For some reason, that set off my fucking Siri on my phone. Alright. But you're gonna have to not just make use of the wall kicks, but also make use of the triple jump. Not like that. Good. I really like this mission, though, because it shows you that the, the challenge isn't in surviving. It's the challenge of actually getting it done. And with the clum clunky A button, this isn't going to actually be easy, but I'll try to use the B button. There we go. That helped. There we go. Voila! There you go. That's it. And uh, if you're going to have a hard time tra traveling on this, that's okay. Just simply switch to the Mario cam. Crouch. And no, no, don't do any of that. What, what are you doing? All right, just don't hit any buttons. Just crawl. Because, you know, you, you know, the challenge was doing the wall kicks. You don't need any more challenge. You can just crawl and easily get our last star of Cool Cool Mountain. And there we go. That's Cool Cool Mountain, guys. Honestly, one of my most iconic and favorite nostalgic levels in this entire game. Unfortunately, that's it. It has come to a close. But, uh, hey, next time on Super Mario 64, like the, uh, the little notice that was saying we need to fight Bowser, I think next time we're actually gonna fight Bowser, alright? So, uh, in the next time that we play this, we'll be entering this big old door and taking a look at what's beyond it, alright? So thank you guys all for watching, see you guys in the next episode, have a great night, bye-bye! Jump, no, that should have definitely made it. I've never had this much trouble on this freaking thing. I can't grab on. I'm gonna get up there anyway. How have I done this so many times? Just jump, Mario! Do what you're famous for! Do what you did to beat Donkey Kong, damn it! Alright, what? I should have definitely made that. What am I doing wrong? Oh my goodness. This is embarrassing. I don't know how the hell I'm done. I'm like not able to make it. I think usually I just swim to like nearest the top and just get it in like my first attempt. That's usually how it goes. Alright, that time I did not even aim for that area. It's like if I'm even slightly off, I just slide.